Hey, what is going on, pros and press? This is Mr. Lyman HD here, and welcome to another Jinx review. Today, we're going to be doing Red Bull, and it's going to be on their summer edition. So, I got this bit of drink out of there around the corner shop, and it cost me price marked. Red Bull's usual expensive price for the 250ml can is £1.19, which, of course, you will know is very expensive for a 250ml can. But, anyways, I give you guys a 4360 of the can. So a fairly simple can design. Uh, their additions are all kind of stoled like this. They've all kind of got the same front, just with different colouring and stuff. So we have the can being green, obviously being kiwi and lime, being my favourite colour, lime green, matches the hat. So I do like this colour. Uh, and then obviously behind it, we kind of have like the Red Bull ball, uh, just kind of cut out in the silvery, shiny you know, background, which does look fairly cool. But like I said, all the additions have the same uh, you know, style on the front. And obviously they've got the orange edition and the other flavours as well. On the bottom, we have nothing, and on the top, everything is all standard and silver, apart from the pool ring, which has a nice cut-out uh, little Red Bull ball in the, uh, you know, in the pool ring, which is small little touches like that, which separate the, well, you know, which separates Red Bull from other brands at the end of the day. So really, really cool small feature, which, of course, they don't have to do. Sugar content is uh, 11 grams per 100 ml, so again, it's just above the average, which is 10 grams. Uh, caffeine content is the usual 32 milligrams per 100 ml, so it's spot on there. Um, as it is full sugar, it shouldn't contain any sweeteners, and I don't think it does because it's full sugar. Nope. Does it contain our favourite vitamins? Uh, uh, let's see, panophenic acid, vitamin B6, B12 and niacin. Yes, it does, and uh, I think that's about it. Uh, Red Bull always put us on their cans. Uh, Appreciated worldwide by top athlete students and in highly demanded professions as well as during long drives. So yeah, and brilliant blue FCF, whatever that is. So this is kiwi and apple. Interesting combo. Apple is you think of apple juice and then you see kiwi and you think, ah, you know, kiwi is kind of like the apple and kiwi. Actually, that's a point. Kiwi and apple. This is basically Renaissance's apple and kiwi. This will be interesting to see what it compares like to that because the apple and kiwi from Morellans is really, really sugary and really, really like, it's just really strong and tastes really, really nice. The apple and kiwi is really, really nice and relentless. So hopefully this is similar, but it could be completely different, but we will find out. So anyways, it's nice and cold. I have got a cup. Let's get straight into it. Hopefully it doesn't explode over me. So we can expect the colour to be, <sighs> we can expect the colour to be green, I'm assuming. Although I've got a feeling it's going to be on the lighter side because apple juice, mm, I don't know, we'll see. Maybe on the lighter side and the smell and taste, well, it's either going to be of apple or kiwi. Don't explode, I think you're okay. There we go. Oh, yes. So it is fizzy. Uh, Quite bubbly, Red Bull seems to be quite fizzy, but they do clear. So it is see-through and it is, yeah, it is green, definitely is green, but it's definitely a very, very light pale green and you can barely notice it, but it's green. Uh, the smell, oh blimey, that smells of, that smells of apples with a hint of kiwi in that. And it smells, it smells just really, really light, sweet. Or well, smells really, really strong, blimey. Okay, so that was the uh, smell. So let's, uh, nevertheless, let's uh, taste some, guys. Oh my. Oh, Red Bull, this is decent. This is decent. Oh, that is lovely. That is absolutely lovely. So, it's not as sweet as, it's not as sweet and as syrupy as you think it is. It's definitely not on the super sweet side. It's a little bit sweet, sweeter than probably average, because apple and kiwi and stuff, you know, they are sweet and stuff. But compared to the relentless apple and kiwi, definitely not as sweet as that. But this is really, really nice. There is a nice apple flavour there, like, it's, it actually tastes of real apple, it doesn't taste fake or anything like that. There's a nice real apple flavour there, not overpowering, it's just really, really nice apple. And then it's backed up by a nice, just a nice kiwi flavour. You, you just notice the kiwi uh, on the end, blended in with the uh, 
apple. Really, really nice combination they've got there. They've done it really, really right. And honestly, I actually prefer this to the Relentless Apple and Kiwi because this isn't as full-on and as, as sugary and syrupy as the Relentless one. This is, maybe because it's like a summer edition, they've kind of tried to make it kind of lighter and easier to drink, you know, because um, sometimes four sugar drinks can just, sometimes they can just be a bit too much sometimes. Like drinking a four 500 mil can of Apple and, you know, Relentless is Apple and Kiwi. Sometimes you just think, oh my God, there's so much sugar in here and all that. But no, this is really, really nice. Um, again, it has to be cold, which it is. So we'll see, the colder it is, the better it tastes. Yeah, that's lovely. That's absolutely lovely. You know, people give Red Bull a hard time all the time. You know, oh, they're overpriced, you know. Oh, they taste all the same. I've always said this on day one. Red Bull, I honestly find, is really, really just fine and just pure and filtered. That might not make sense to some people, but... Honestly, like drinking this and then after drinking the Relentless Apple and Kiwi, I much prefer this one. It's just so much more smoother and refined, not just tons of, sh you know, full on tons of syrup and sugar in your mouth. This is, it's a really, really nice drink. Really, really impressed with this. And you know what? I I only saw this in the Random Corner Shop. Like I said, I've never, I haven't seen this flavour yet in a supermarket or anything else. So, uh, you know, hopefully it becomes a bit more common before summer finishes. I'll certainly be buying a couple more cans of these. But this is lovely, guys. Yeah, same, it tastes the same out of the can. It's a really, really nice drink. You know what? If you guys can find this, pick it up. Trust me. If you like apple and all that, and you've tried the apple with lettuce and kiwi, try both of these, and I guarantee you'll like these. You like the Red Bull better than the Apple Random Security, unless obviously you know you like full on syrup and sugar. But nevertheless, like I said, that's really really nice drink. Really really proud of that. I don't mind paying one pound nineteen for the few cans of this here and there because it's Red Bull at the end of the day. So I definitely gets a thumbs up for me. So as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later.